Today I'm celebrating Celine Dion with I Surrender from the 2007 DVD Live in Vegas, A New Day. It's a song I that's one of my most favourites out of her whole catalogue. But did you know some of the things that maybe you do as an avid fan? I did not know way, way back where this song came from. So I did a bit, bit of research. And it came from A New Day Has Come, which was, listen to this, the 18th studio album and 7th English language album by Canadian singer Celine Dion at the time by Sony Music in 2002. So imagine from Eurovision, her Eurovision win, to 2002, she had, and this song comes from, her 18th album. That's phenomenal. She's still suffering, as everybody knows, with the stiff person syndrome, better known as SPD. I'm getting it right and saying it slowly for people from foreign countries to understand. That is what she's suffering from. It's a neurological disease. She has a great medical team around her. She's got love and wishes coming from all over the world still. And it was beautiful to watch her on the Grammys with her son Renee being led on stage to present Taylor Swift with her award. I think that was the biggest comeback since the announcement of this particular syndrome that she is suffering from. I wish you all the best, Celine, but this song is just staggered me when, when I read the research and said it came from her 18th studio album and that was in 2002. Well, it did. And that album garnered most positive reviews from music critics at the time. You notice Dion explored a broader, more adventurous range of pop music and dipped her toe into modern music, particularly dance pop. Sorry for love. However, the album also contains the usual adult contemporary songs, including what we're going to play today, the power ballad, I Surrender. We go to what the meaning of the song is. And it's about a person who finds the courage to fully forgive themselves to someone they deeply love. Isn't that Celine all over? I hope you enjoy this live performance. And excuse me, it's live. I just have to turn away. <coughs> oh, excuse me. All live today. I need a coffee. <laughs> but I'll get one after this. Let's enjoy Celine Dion, let's continue to send her love and prayers and let's continue to savour her music. I surrender, never surrender Celine. I think it, it should be your anthem song, I really do, simply because what you're battling at the moment, you brought awareness to thousands of other people throughout the world, millions even, who knows, when it comes to stiff person syndrome. For that, we shall always give you eternal thanks, but your music we shall always love.
That is why we love her, everybody, because we do. We surrender every time she sings a song. You just surrender everything, don't you? You just feel, woof. I Surrender it was a song, as I said. It's about the courage to give themselves to someone they deeply love. Now, the lyrics expressed a desire to let go of fear and hesitation in order to fully embrace this love. Celine recognizes there is much life left to experience, and she's willing to take a chance on love. She wanted to abandon their fears, her fears and insecurities, and stand up for her dreams and desires. Because the chorus says in the phrase, I'd surrender everything. And that everybody means to speak this person, Celine, who she's singing to. And I think she's probably, well, let's just say she's got Renee in her head, is willing to give up everything, anything and everything to be with the person they love. She believed that their love was so strong and so strong enough to overcome any obstacle and that together they could face any challenge. Celine was willing to do whatever it took, she, according to the lyrics, to make that relationship work and to experience a new sense of hope and joy. Now in the bridge of the lyrics, when we get to them, Celine struggles to be away from her loved one. 
The fire of their love is stronger every day and they can no longer ignore it. They need to swallow their pride and admit their feelings. And then it goes back to the chorus repeating again and that's emphasising a willingness to give everything up for this love. In conclusion of what she's just sung about, the song concludes with a final repetition of the chorus of the lines, right now I give my life to live again. And at the moment we all know Celine would give her life to be back on stage again and to beat this stiff person syndrome that she has. And as the lines say here, I'll break free, take me, and I hope she does. My everything, I'll surrender all to you. And at the moment she's surrendering everything she has to the medical team around her, to the love of her fans, and to the well wishes within her own family. I know that's where her heart belongs on stage, and we all want it for you, Celine. More than you know and desire, we miss you. But memories like this, and I surrender, will always be memories that will hold dear to me. Anyway, to finish, the lines express for me a sense of urgency and determination to break free from old patterns and to embrace a new love that will give Celine life again. Overall, I finish by saying I Surrender is a powerful anthem about power of love, overcoming fear, hesitation, and the willingness to give everything for true love. Amen to that. Thanks for listening. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Take care for now.